all the directives issued by His Excellency the President of Uganda on the 15th of October 2022 will be extended for another 21 days. In her address last evening, the Minister of Health, Dr. Jenotha Cheng, announced that the lockdown in Posdon, Mobende and Kasanda districts had been extended for another 21 days. The silence and minimal movement within Mobende town this morning were indeed reflective of the extended lockdown. But this extension has not been welcomed by the residents. They point out that they have been largely compliant with the restrictions as well as the standard operating procedures to minimize the spread of the disease. The residents have blamed this extension on their neighbors in Kasanda district whom they claim have failed to comply with the regulations. <laughs> When the resident district commissioner Rosemary Bavashaija agrees with the extension and has called upon the residents to comply with the restrictions. I just beg that they just adhere so that when the 21 days are over, then we are done. Because if we don't join hands, then it will still affect us. They will keep on extending, extending. We may even come to Janam when they extend it. She also points out that government will need to offer more food relief now that the lockdown has been extended. Say that uh, the work done by the Prime Minister's office was very well done because the food would come, would reach us. We also make sure it reaches the sub counties. Uh, only that now that they have extended the lockdown, in the future we shall need more food. I think it will keep us through these other coming 21 days. However, Biabashaija expressed concern at reports of mistreatment of residents by security personnel called in to enforce the lockdown restrictions. Uganda Medical Association also concurs with the decision to extend the lockdown in both districts. The 21 days are paramount to avoid any case, suspect or probable and, and positive cases from leaving the vicinity of Mubende. Kassanda and entering other places because you know we are going to a very heavy festive season. You want those two areas clean, spotless. Meanwhile, Dr. Oledo has warned that residents of Kassanda need to take the Ebola situation more seriously than before if the epidemic is to be combated. Of Kassanda, please, Ebola is not a political disease. It's a disease that has killed even us, the health workers. So far we are six who have died, the health workers. It is true it is killing people. So, these things of you de defying the presidential directive of at this time going to a witch doctor? Please, if you're sick now in Kassanda, first go to a health facility. It then ruled out any other condition. Joyce Nakato, NTV Weekend Edition.